Oh, hello, Mr. Williams. The thing is, like, I tried to upload my video on YouTube, but it was hard to do it. I don't know why. So what I did is I took a video of a video. So please do not judge me on the video quality. Thank you. Hello, the instructor. I hope you're having a really good time there at your place, that you're comfortable, because here I'm having a really good time doing my speech. So my classmate Allison, if I'm not wrong, brought last Friday some condoms to class. So I brought my condoms here, you know, strawberry condoms. <laughs> So, condoms are defined by the Merriam-Webster dictionary as a thin rubber covering used by men while having sex in order to prevent a woman to become pregnant or to spread disease. Allison's main points were the following. First, HIV AIDS in Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge is the sixth largest city in the, in the, in the country high the highest amount of HIV AIDS. Also, it's the first largest city in the state of Louisiana having the highest amount of HIV AIDS. Her second point was HIV AIDS in college students. So, HIV AIDS is very popular and it's common between college students because I accept myself. We go crazy, we drink, we smoke, and we don't take uh, proper caution when having sex. Her third point was um, HIV AIDS among minorities. So she talked about the African Americans being the largest minority having the highest population of HIV AIDS. She also explained the reasons and why that happens. So she has three negative aspects for her speech, at least by me. First, she read too much of the paper. Second, she stand still while she was talking. And third, after her introduction was, was really awesome, she stopped interacting with the public. I think that happened because she was reading on the paper. Also, she had three positive aspects of her speech. She used references to back up her sources. That was her first point. And then second, she was very informed on her topic and she talked about Baton Rouge, the city we all live and the city we all have, well, I have classes and where I meet you, the instructor. And then three, she organized her thoughts and she organized her speech uh, in the format of having an introduction, three main points, and then a conclusion. And she used the second canon of rhetoric, the arrangement, by the book. In overall, I think it was a really nice, interactive, and informative um, speech, but she has to work on um, signposting, avoiding, avoiding reading, and also getting more interaction with the public. So, thank you very much for listening to my video. I wish you the best. Have a good time. And then, see you later. Well, on, I'm just going to call my friend. And we're going to go and use the strawberry condoms. I'm just kidding. Bye.